Welcome to Let's Read Mobile, presented by the Boys and Girls Clubs of South Alabama. I'm Miss Karen, and I'm going to read a story from the series Fancy Nancy by Jane O'Connor. This one is called Fancy Nancy Sees Stars. Stars are so fascinating. That's a fancy word for interesting. I love how they sparkle in the sky. Tonight is our class trip. Yes, it's a class trip at night. We are going to the planetarium. That is a museum about stars and planets. Ms. Glass tells us the show starts at eight. We will all meet there. I smile at my friend Robert. My parents are taking Robert and me. Then Ms. Glass asks, what star is closest to Earth? That's easy, it's the sun. What do you call stars that make a picture? Asks Ms. Glass. Robert and Bree have both forgotten. I know, I know, I say, a constellation. Ms. Glass nods. On the walls are pictures. There's the hunter and the crab and the Big Dipper. It looks like a big spoon. We will see all of them at the show and I can hardly wait. At home, Robert and I put glow in the dark stickers on our t-shirts. Mine has the Big Dipper. Robert has the hunter on his. We spin my mobile and watch the planets orbit the sun. Orbit is a fancy word. It means to travel in a circle. Then we pretend to orbit and we get dizzy. Later, we bake star cookies. Sprinkles make them sparkle. The sun is a star, I tell my sister. It is the closest star, so we see it in the day. After dinner, we wait for the babysitter. She's very late. Dad says not to worry, we have plenty of time. At last, we get in the car. Drip, 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 it's raining. The rain comes down harder and harder. Dad drives slower and slower, and it is getting later and later. A policeman comes over. The road's closed, he tells my parents. There is too much water. Oh no, there are cars in front of us, there are cars behind us, and we are stuck. The show is starting soon, Robert says. We will not make it. Drip, drip, drip goes the rain. Drip, drip, drip go my tears. Robert and I are so sad. We do not even want any cookies. At last, the cars move and the rain stops, but it's too late. The night sky show is over. By the time we get home, the sky is full of stars. They are brilliant. That is a fancy word for shiny and bright. I get a brilliant idea. Brilliant also means very smart. We can have our own night sky, our own night sky show. My parents get my sister. We set up beach chairs, mom lights candles, dad puts the cookies on a tray, and we eat al fresco. Oh, well, that's fancy for eating outdoors. We watch the stars. We see the North Star. We see the Big Dipper. All at once, something zooms across the sky. A shooting star, dad says. Make a wish. I tell dad it is not a star. It is a meteor but I make a wish anyway. The next day, Ms. Glass says, everyone missed the show because of the storm, so we will go next week. Everybody is very happy, and guess what? My wish came true. Thank you for joining us today. Don't forget to watch us next time, and until then, let's read Mobile.